Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kritika and I am a freelance architect with passion of design and teaching. I work on all kinds of projects from architecture to interior design and one tool that has been a game changer for me is Kuhum. Kuhum is a cloud-based platform so you can work from anywhere with just internet access. Kuhum is my go-to tool for creating quick 3D models and renders with its drag and drop simplicity and lightning fast rendering. It's packed with an extensive library of furnitures and materials making it so easy to customize your projects to perfection. It saves me so much time and today I'll show you how I create my projects in Kuhum. Don't forget to check out the link in description box for a special offer just waiting for you. So, let's dive into the tutorial. First, go to the Kuhum website. At the top right corner, click on New 3D Project and then select New House Project. This opens up the Kuhum architecture interface where all the design magic happens. Now, let's get familiar with the workspace. On the left, we have options like Build, Decorate, Material and Library which holds all the tools you will need – walls, roofs, doors and more. At the top, there are essential options like File, Save, Undo, Redo, Toolkit, Render and Gallery. On the right, the Properties panel shows your current view, navigation details and floor levels. At the bottom, you can see the floor planes and easily switch between 2D and 3D views. Finally. At the center, your main workspace, where we will be building our design. Let's start by creating the walls. Select the wall tool from the build section. Click, drag and drop to draw your walls, entering the dimensions as needed. You can adjust the height and thickness of the walls from the properties panel. Next, we will add roof. Using the Roof tool from the Build section, adjust the angle and shape to match your design. It only takes a few clicks to create a complete roof. For the plinth, I'll create a new basement level with the height of 600mm. After that, I'll use the Slab tool to add flooring to this level. To create step, at the front of the cabin, go to the build, then arch and structure. Here you will find stairs and steps. Choose a style, place it and customize size and design to fit your project. Now it's time to add doors and windows. Head over to library and select the styles you like. Drag and drop into the place, it's that simple. Let's decorate the cabin by adding rich details, eaves, door frames and other decorative elements. The library has so many options to choose from. You can get creative with your design.
With the modeling is done, it's time to add materials. Go to the materials section, choose the textures you like and apply them to your cabin. This step brings the design to life and gives it a polished, realistic look. Now for the final step, rendering. At the top, click on render and select architecture. Choose the surroundings for your scene and the rendering interface will open up. On the left, you will find options like scene settings, advanced setting, ambient light. At the top, you can select the render type, photo, panorama or video. Adjust the camera settings on the right and at the bottom, set the ratio and resolutions. Once everything is ready, hit render and your final design will appear in the gallery. And that's how I use Kuhum for creating stunning architecture projects for my clients. Whether you are a designer, an architect, or someone who just likes to create beautiful spaces, Kuhum has something for everyone. Make sure to check out the description box below for special link to try out Kuhum with exclusive offers. Trust me, you don't want to miss it out. Follow me on Instagram at the rate art.iki where I'm hosting a giveaway for Kuhum subscription. Don't forget to check it out and participate for a chance to win. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow creatives and subscribe for more such tips, tutorials and inspiration. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.